And I'll tell you, it gets really cold. But let's dig into um, what the Wendigo is actually described as. Uh, the creature is often depicted as uh, gaunt to the point of uh, emaciation, with its skin pulled like really tauntly over its bones, which are, are visible beneath its flat. So its eyes are pushed back deep into its sockets, and it has a, a gray complexion like death. The Wendigo is said to smell like decay or corruption, whatever that smells like. Now in the tales, the uh, the Wendigo isn't just born from the ether. It's it's often portrayed as a spirit who possesses uh, a human being. And what causes the possession? Well, uh, it's actually usually associated with the taboo of cannibalism. So the stories suggest that if a, a person resorts to eating human flesh, they they might become a Wendigo them 